The man accused of hitting a Spring Valley store clerk with a hatchet faced a judge today. 10 News reporter Steve Fiorina is live at the store. Steve, the clerk didn't believe he was in danger at first. Kim, I'm told the clerk here actually laughed when the masked man pointed a gun at him. It was a BB gun and a BB fell out of the barrel. But he thought it was a joke for only a second. It got very serious very quickly. Witnesses said Harold Hill flew off his bicycle as he tried to flee the scene of a robbery and hatchet attack on Saturday. Perhaps the source of the mark on his cheek clearly visible during his video arraignment in El Cajon Court. He's charged with the holdup of the Hamishaw Produce Market. A 10 News camera shows that a few minutes later, obviously there was a violent struggle. The store in shambles, a blood trail out the door. After the victim put the money in the bag, the defendant then struck the victim in the head two to three times with the hatchet, causing serious injury to the victim's face. The robber dropped the hatchet and ran out to a bicycle parked near the door. But there was a man in an SUV who witnessed the attack. He gunned his car and he hit him. I hit him with the car. He, he got up and limped off towards that way. The robber dropped the money and ran into the nearby mobile home park, where a police dog found him hiding underneath one of the homes. Hill is charged with attempted murder. And that count alone uh, carries more than 25 years exposure. Count two, he is charged with mayhem, also um, using a deadly weapon, namely the hatchet. And a robbery charge. Bail was set at $1 million. Neighbors say that Hill, who has a record and two burglary convictions, said he lived in this park and he also shopped at the market over here behind me. The uh, clerk again is out of the hospital and recovering. Live in Spring Valley, Steve Fiorina, 10 News.